Hi, my name is Brooke Pancake. I graduated from the University of Alabama. I majored in marketing and I played women's golf. I can't even describe what it was like winning the national championship. It still hasn't even settled for me yet. After making that final putt and us winning by one shot, it was, uh, it was incredible. I couldn't think of a better way to, you know, to have left the program in, in that way. It's only, you know, it's only going to be getting better and for her to be a part of the first national championship team and being there with Mick was, was great. And being able to go down and, and get our rings at a football game in November and just having, you know, the 100,000 people around in the stadium cheering for you, that's, that's, that's when it's going to hit me. Being a student athlete, the, being a leader, they kind of go together. I, I think I kind of built being a leader by example through sports and academics and uh, community service roles. I wanted just to help everybody on the team. I wanted our team to be the best and I knew that I had to, to do more than just focus on myself for that. My top academic achievement would have been winning Capital One Academic All-American of the Year this year. I, I was pretty stunned. <laughs> I didn't know that I had, had reached that level, but that was pretty much the ultimate feeling of your hard work's paid off when it comes to your academics. In college, the biggest obstacle I faced would have been the tornado experience that we went through the end of my junior year. It hit probably about 500 yards from us, if that. For me to come back and, and be able to, to help out just you know, made me feel like I was, doing, I, I was doing what I needed to be doing at that point. Ever since nationals, I've been traveling like crazy. I've been um, pursuing my professional career and I played on the U.S. team over in Scotland for the Curtis Cup, actually against a teammate, um, Stephanie Meadows. She played for the European team. And then I played in the U.S. Open and I've basically been traveling ever since. And that's what my dreams are at this point. I'm gonna pursue them with everything I have.